Guys, check this out. What I have behind me is a brand new 2020 Nissan Titan XD. And I'm here in Mississippi at the first drive event. And in this video, I'm gonna give you a walk around on the new truck and also take it for a drive around here with a 10,000 pound trailer. For 2020, the truck has been updated and primarily on the outside. So it has a new fascia, new headlights, LED signature, new bumper down here. And this one is a Pro 4X. It's got a monochromatic look. This is a brand new color. It's got a blacked out grill. And what Nissan is doing for 2020 is they're trying to make each trim level a little bit more unique. So this blacked out look here is a Pro 4X off-road version, but it can still tow a heck of a lot. For 2020, the Titan XD is gonna be available only as a crew cab 4x4. And Nissan looks at it as a basically a big towing package for the Nissan Titan because they also have the regular Titan and this XD is all about towing. So let's look under the hood and see what kind of power we have. And hey guys, you got Steve here behind the camera shooting for Andre. And of course, the engine in this truck is definitely a big deal. So Andre, what do we got here, man? Tell heck, them about it. Heck yeah, Steve. Uh, this is a 5.6 liter V8 gas engine. The five liter turbo diesel Cummins V8 is no longer available. And this engine for 2020 on premium fuel gets a new rating, 400 horsepower and 413 pound feet of torque. If you put regular fuel in this, regular octane 87, you could, the rating is about 390 horsepower and 394 pound feet of torque. So it doesn't matter which fuel you use, you still have pretty good power. But the big deal is the nine speed automatic transmission that's now backing up this engine. The, new, the old 7-speed is no more. And I've always liked this engine. The 5.6 liter V8 has always been great. Here's how it sounds. Okay. Steven, did you hear that? Man, that sounds so good. And check out the revs. Let me show you. It doesn't limit you, really. Look. It goes straight to red line, about 6,000 RPM, a little bit more, and it's quick revving. It doesn't kind of wait to come down in RPM. Really great engine. And another thing that's new for this year is actually the interior. They've updated a lot on the inside. Just look at this new Pro 4X with the stitching and, of course, the badging. It's got their special new red color. It looks a little bit more orange to me, but... Ooh, <laughs> the, the horn works. But the other thing that's new is... And I don't know, maybe you should come around and yeah, see this. Yeah, let around for you, Andrea. Let's go check out the interior on this guy. Check this out. This Pro 4X has the new 9-inch infotainment system, and this whole center console has been redone. And look at the quality, I mean the resolution on the screen. Really great, crisp navigation screen. And of course you have menus, you have uh, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto and you can access the cameras you have a 360 degree view in the back you do have you know proximity sensors and the trailer of course is there and you can kind of go through the cameras a little bit on the side and then the... so they've we've done this but some of the buttons remain the same so you still have your uh, heated steering wheel button right here uh, on the bottom, you do have an integrated trailer brake controller, which is very important for towing. That's nice. Yep, and USB-C, USB, heated and cooled and ventilated seats. And for 2020, Steven, check this out. Whoa. A phone holder. Nice. So you could always... That's interesting. Uh, put your phone in here. Check it out. And you could still charge it while it's in this position. So. That's really neat. Of course, the cup holders are also removable. Yeah. And for 2020, another big, huge difference is the driver assistance technologies. Uh, Nissan now has adaptive cruise control, lane departure warning system. Um, that's all standard on every Nissan Titan and Titan XD. Uh, well, let's look at the hitch and the frame because that's really important for towing. And let's get on the road. We got a nice uh, Kubota 
diesel side by side up there we're pulling. Are you gonna take it off road later? Oh, I'd love to, man. That thing looks awesome. <laughs> yeah, well, check this out, guys. Come over here. So you might be wondering why I have a Titan, regular Titan, and Titan XD. And if you look in the profile, Steven, so if we walk around just a smidge, yeah, uh, Titan XD is just bigger. So I, I don't know if you can tell from here, but you can kind of see the frame below. The frame is actually fatter on the XD. It's really tall. So the truck, the whole truck sits taller than the regular Titan then it's longer it's still a crew cab but it has basically a six and a half foot bed in the back so if you want towing you want longer wheelbase bigger trucks sturdier frame and the maximum towing rating is eleven thousand and forty pounds on this four-wheel drive crew cab that's obviously not best in class if you look at other trucks but still eleven thousand pounds for a truck like this is great if you want to tow more than that you really need a three-quarter ton truck or maybe a one-ton truck to do that. Let's look at the trailer. This is one beefy trailer. And um, right here we have a two-inch receiver still. Same as before. This trailer weighs about 8,000 pounds. We have about a 2,000 pound load on it. But if you wanted to tow a gooseneck, you can still do that. This truck is available with a gooseneck fifth wheel prep package. You still have your tie down rails on the side all the way around. You can put additional uh, hooks in here. There is also, I can't open the tailgate here, but there's also a charger. Nice. There's also an outlet in the back so you can charge your tools maybe. And for fifth wheel and gooseneck towing, here you go, you have a seven pin connector. So. You're pretty well equipped for towing. Nice. This is not a true three-quarter ton truck, but the payload on this particular Pro 4X off-road version of the XD for 2020 is 1,929 pounds, according to the sticker. Check it out. Tiny, tiny numbers right there. And one more thing. You're probably wondering about fuel economy. Well, I didn't have a chance to test it right here at this event, but this XD has a gross vehicle weight rating of 8,800 pounds, which means it's not EPA rated. So it's a kind of a heavy duty truck, class 2B. And when we get it to Colorado, we'll give you fuel economy numbers there, but just not in this video. So there's only one thing left to do right now is to take it on the road and see how this massive Titan XD tows. And this is a pretty heavy load. Okay, let's go for a drive, Andre. Are you ready, dude? Let's do it, man. Let's <laughs> see how this beast tows. Yes. So I got tow hole mode enabled. Okay. The trailer brake controller is set. Um, the gain is at about four right now. Let me let me test and see how my, much brake I have. Oh feels yeah, nice. it's, it's grabbing. Yeah, feels so nice. it's it's not too bad. We do have ten thousand pounds, so we gotta stop it somehow. All right, let's see how the nine speed does. Yeah, for sure. Cause that's probably the biggest change in the powertrain. Right? Like a little bit more power, but yeah. the change to the nine speed for sure is a big deal, especially when everyone else has gone to tens, right? Yeah, and when whenever you have kind of um, more gears. You have a little bit, you know, better gear ratio spread. Sure. You have a kind of a lower gear at the, you know, like the first gear, and then you have more efficiency at the top end. Oh, that's the theory. For sure. So off the line, how'd it feel? It's good. Plenty of power for this 10,000 pound trailer. And the transmission was pretty smooth still. I mean, I drove uh, the smaller truck, the new Titan, sure. the 2020 the with the trailer. Time. Yeah, and that was at high elevation, so that was a completely different bag. Sure. But here, kind of a lower elevation, there's more power, transmission still feels really good. And it's holding a gear, so I'm in tow haul mode, and it's still holding about 2,000 RPM. I don't know exactly what gear I'm in, it doesn't tell me. I really like the additional gauges on the Titan truck, and this goes for the regular Titan and the XD. I got transmission temp, I got oil temp, uh, coolant temp, so I can monitor all those vital signs, and it's all on the digital screen, right, right, right here. And of course, this is an off-road focused truck, a Pro 4X. We do have Bilstein shocks, so special shocks, but they're also pretty good on the road. 
and with the trailer, even with the weight, I don't know exactly how much the truck squatted with this particular trailer. I wasn't able to measure it yet, but the ride is just, it's, it's good. And the steering feels just, you know, firm. Nice. So I know a lot of the uh, driving aids there are new for 2022. Have you felt anything uh, pulling no. you this way or that way? Or? No, no, no. Um, and actually the lane, Departure warning it's system is currently off, off gotcha. um, but the, the adaptive cruise control system is here. Cool. So you could always engage it, and I'm going to do it now. So I don't know if you could see that. It's in the upper right. So you can adjust the speed, and you can also adjust the distance, the distance. to the vehicle ahead of you. Yes. You guys have probably seen our other reviews on the 2020 Titan, the regular truck, but the pricing hasn't been available yet, but we have it now. The regular 2020 Titan starts at just over 36,000 bucks, and that's for a king cab, two-wheel drive. The XDs start at just over 44,000 bucks, and that's, once again, crew cab, four-wheel drive only. This Pro 4X starts, once again, crew cab, four by four, starts at around 54,000 bucks. And if you load the truck all the way up with a platinum and all the options, that could be over 61 grand. The pricing is competitive and for 2020, this truck is still rock solid with a trailer behind it, but it's even better than it was because you have new styling, new technology on the inside and the Fender audio system is mwah, one of the best stereo systems I've ever listened to. And guys, go back to tfltruck.com for more news views and real world truck reviews from first drive events right here in Mississippi.